Hello, this is Easy, and I have this little strip you're going to try if you want to. It'll be below the video. And it is a plug in, and it's called uh, Brush Flip It. Uh, it's designed for these uh, vector type brushes, as this Chisel 3D is a vector type. And you can always tell if it's uh, the vector type because there'll be 3D text right here. It'll show it. So, if I used it, the default one, let's say a nose drag out uh, it's upside down I don't like that but if I drag up it's correct uh, I'm not accustomed to dragging that way and it takes a lot of fun out of it that's why I created this uh, brush flip it uh, it's gonna be located in your brush palette you'll see the button from the mesh and if you move your mouse to the left side of that button there's be a transparent button called flip it once I put my mouse over you up in the main brush there you'll see the text called flip it so we're going to press flip it and then we're going to drag down that's how I want it right there uh, always keep an eye on this brush here the alpha not this one up here because um, whatever you see here is what's going to be applied okay so if I select uh, see the ear here I just drag over there and I got the ear now if you look at the way the ear is facing also you want your model facing how you want to apply the ear all right so before I do anything I'm just going to press flip it all right as an example what would screw up if I turn it to this side and drag out it's all backwards control Z that go to this side and drag out just like the picture shows here and then I'll come out correctly I want some cherry on. Control do that. And add some more geometry. Uh, let's select another one here. Let's select uh, this eye. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and flip it. And this looks like it might be a right eye. So I'm going to bring my cursor on the right, not the left. Uh, you'll see my cursor on the right because it's got the focal shift to it and it's got the cross white hairs to it. So I'll drag it down. There you get something like that. Anytime that you select a brush, and make sure it's updated here. And just press flip it. And then we're going to apply it here. Very simple. All you got to do is select a brush press flip it and like I said the link would be the low of the video if you want to try it thank you very much